Hi everyone, welcome back to This is the Bent Knitter. So this week we're going to be doing a another yarn review. This one I had in my stash for a while now. Um, I got a, at a yarn convention that I went to with a friend. And it's been kind of sitting in my stash and I finally decided to pull it out and use it. It's been a little while. So um, I decided to do a scarf with this uh, yarn. Um, the company that makes it is called Priya. Um, like always, I will put the description, uh, the details in the description below with all uh, what it is and where to find it with the website. Um, so that way you can guys can go take a look. Now this yarn is going to be more on the expensive side because it is handmade, very unique, um, uh, kind of specialized, but. You do get get about 390 meters or 430 yards with it, so it's a nice size skein of yarn, and it is super fine or fingering yarn. So it is uh, skinnier yarn for this. Now, uh, the colorway that I got on the is called actually Dirty Heavy, which is quite interesting. But um, this is how it turned out with the scarf. Um, as you can see, there's uh kind of a gentle lead into one color from another. Um, there's not really like any uh, striping that much um, or really kind of one jump into the next. Some colors um, are much more of a gradual kind of fade, um, but also like this is actually a very good point, um, kind of like that pinkish reddish into the or orange is very subtle, very gradual change, which is nice. Um, but with the orange into the yellow, there's much more of a noticeable difference in change. Um, but it, I love how it changes from one color to another. It's very unique, very subtle. Um, there's no jump. It, it, and also, it is also one strand of yarn. There's no knots. It is one continuous yarn, which is nice. So that way you don't have to worry about that. Uh, I know with some other yarns that I've discussed before, there has been knots or jumping from one color to another, but this is very gradual. This is very nice, so that way you can kind of blend over the course of your project. So with something a little bit bigger, if you're doing a shawl or a blanket, it'll look great in terms of uh, shading and coloring throughout the project. Um, especially if you get a couple skeins of it, you can go from like one color and, and back. So highly recommend it. There's also um, all the coloring, just for, as a callback from last week, none of the yarn kind of bled or got off of my hands or the needles, so that's always a plus. Um, but it is very well done, very nice color. It's also very soft. Um, it is uh, merino yarn, so it is very soft and to the touch, so it would be great for kind of um stuff for your around your neck or for your face like hats or cowls or something like that um it would be nice to have it for those projects too not just for like blankets too so a nice little change great for scarves now like i said i will put all the details in the description below in case anybody's wondering and I will see you next week. Don't forget to mention in the comments if you have any other yarn you want me to review or check out. Let me know. Love checking out new yarn. I will see you next week. Bye.